Everybody and happy Tuesday, April 12th. A shooter on the loose in Brooklyn, New York, subway shooter, approximately four and a half hour ago on rush hour, um, apparently wearing a green vest, <coughs> excuse me, five foot five African American, wearing a uh, construction, um, green construction vest, make it clear, green, not yellow, no motive at this time. Apparently, 16 people are being hospitalized, uh, treating 16 patients at this time. Thank God, no deaths, less prayers with those individuals. Apparently, uh, there's no motive, uh, but the shooter is on the loose. Let me make it clear that this is no act of terrorism. Um, and they also, early um, preliminary, um, there is no bombs or anything like that. But apparently, what we know here is... Uh, Eight people were shot on the subway. Uh, other people were just falling, and you can hear the shots on this here live. Um, eight people shot on the subway of New York in Brooklyn on the 36th Street. Uh, I was on that subway once or twice when I lived back east in New York for about a year. Um, so if, let me give you this. So all subways have four doors, right? Four doors, only two open. So how did this guy get out so quick? Where are the cameras at? Um, apparently, they're going by description of the people who seen this man run out. So they're trying to get more information. All we know now is schools are closed, small businesses are closed, and they're locked down here until they get this uh, creep who did this awful thing. Um, you know, this is Easter week. On Sunday, it's Easter Sunday, so there's a lot of family and people traveling. So there's more people on subways in each state. Um, right now, crime. I did some. I did. I had to look some things up, and um, let me have a little coffee. I thank everybody for joining me here. Um, I greatly appreciate it uh, if you would share this video and get this video out on some of the footage I got here. But 88 percent. 88% of crime in New York is up just in a year. You know, you got to point fingers at, you know, the uh, governor, the mayor, and everything around, um, you know, defunding the police department and things like that. But it's some tragedy times right now. Crime is just everywhere. Crime is just going up. Uh, these things here should not happen. People can lose their life and getting shot. Um, again, there's no motive at this time. This guy just gets on. You can hear some of the shots in the background there. I'll stay quiet for a second. Uh, again, the man was wearing a green construction vest. Schools and businesses are on lockdown. Um, horrible, horrible time. Um, on this here uh, about 10 shots um, they're saying um, there was a couple shots we heard right there at least three or four um, in that quick um, video but uh, all we know is the New York shooter uh, is on the loose again this happened about four and a half hours ago maybe five hours ago rush hour um, in East Coast New York City in Brooklyn um, crazy crazy times I like everybody to be safe um, if you live in that area uh, let's make sure that you we they know this for a fact that he's wearing a green construction not yellow this is confirmed green construction vest um, african-american about five foot five and um, he's on the loose now they say that he was wearing a gas mask and there was some gas explosion uh, gas why he did that who knows um, but um, man of terror let's call him the man of terror man of terror and a gas mask who shoots at least 10 shots in brooklyn subway uh, during the rush hour so uh, maybe that will be a good title man of terror um, in which we have going on now with the recession um, and everything else that's going on in this world um you're always going to have crazy people and what happens and why people tick um, is beyond me sometimes um, what makes that part of the brain um, just say well I'm gonna start shooting we all have bad days but to start shooting innocent people whether those people have to do with anything that's going on in your head it has absolutely nothing um, go home and um, and, and, and you know hit, hit, hit your walls a few times if you're having a bad day but these are sick people but I got to tell you, as, um, you know, gas prices and um, everything else that's going on, uh, shortage of food and food going up and we're hitting a recession in summer, um, 
you know, it's 75 years now. Um, the economy is out of control. And uh, some of this can trigger that out in individuals. Um, sometimes you just have people wake up and just lose their mind. Others are off their medication or drugs or alcohol and so on and so forth. But a lot of these crimes are going up because of this nation after a pandemic or still in a pandemic a lot of people would say you're going to have these tragedy times um you know you would think that the um, administration would address this matter um and and hopefully um we get a grip and we catch this sob on this sad tuesday as these people at least 16 people now um, in a hospital, uh, 16 patients are getting treated, excuse me, eight people shot, um, and, and just my prayers are with them, and they can pull through. Thank you for watching this uh, video today. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, like and subscribe, and I will be back on later on with some finance information. Um, thank you. God bless.